In this video, we're diving into a game-changing technology that's revolutionizing the e-commerce world for small businesses, text-to-image AI tools. I'm gonna to walk you through a step-by-step -step demo of five leading text-to-image AI tools, showing you exactly how to get the best results and apply them for your business. Let's get into it. Before we start the tutorial, let's quickly go over the AI tools I'll be using in this video. Midjourney is great for high-end product shots and lifestyle images. Dolly from OpenAI is an awesome tool for quick iterations and concept testing. Adobe Firefly comes in handy for businesses worried about usage rights, as it's been designed specifically with legal compliance in mind. PicoPilot is fantastic for virtual try-ons and image enhancements that are sure to sell your products faster. And Ideogram should be your go-to when it comes to creating logos and promotional posters. If you're already excited about using these AI tools for your business, we've created a comprehensive guide that takes all the guesswork out of getting started. I know jumping into AI content creation as a beginner can feel overwhelming, but here's the thing. This free resource takes all that complexity and turns it into a simple, actionable roadmap for creating amazing content. Over 87,000 creators are already using it to transform their content game. I've linked this free offer down in the description, so feel free to take a look and let me know in the comments which section you found helpful. All right, let's begin with Mid Journey. I'm starting with this one because it's absolutely crushing it for product photography right now. The first step is setting up your account. We'll head to midjourney.com where you can log in or sign up using a Discord or Google account to get started. Now you'll be able to see your initial workspace. Let's go to the Create tab where the Join Now pop-up will take you to their various subscription plans, which start at $10 a month or $8 a month billed annually. Once you've signed up for a plan, you'll be taken back to your workspace. The second step is writing effective prompts. The secret to high quality professional images is all in how you talk to the AI. So you'll need to be clear and specific. Here's an example that works well. Professional photo of a leather messenger bag with studio lighting, clean white background, AK resolution, commercial style. See what happened there? Let's break down why this works. We told it exactly what kind of image we want professional products photo. We specified the product details, leather messenger bag. We added in the technical stuff, studio lighting, white background. And finally, we threw in those quality boosters, AK resolution, commercial style. Now watch what happens when we change things up. Editorial style photo of a leather messenger bag with dramatic lighting, dark background, high contrast, commercial style. With just a few tweaks in your prompts, Midjourney can produce professional, realistic product images that perfectly match your vision. If you're finding this tutorial helpful so far, please hit that like button so that the algorithm shows it to more people. And step three, we'll fine tune our results. Here we have some editing options. So once you select an image, you'll see options like upscale, which boosts resolutions for a sharper image, or vary, which creates new versions with slight tweaks, and a few more. There are also some adjusting settings in the editor where you can set the aspect ratio based on your needs or stylize by moving the slider to adjust how much artistic flair you'd like for creating new prompts. Okay, this is where things get really exciting. Let me show you how to see your products on different models without hiring a single person. For this demo, we'll use Pitco Pilot to quickly create a virtual try-on that showcases the product across different models. Here's a simple t-shirt design. Watch what happens when we feed it into our AI tool, choose a model, pick a pose and let it work its magic. Nice! Unlike the other tools, there's no need for detailed prompts. However, there are two key elements to keep in mind for these virtual try-ons. The first is starting with a clean product shot, and the second is choosing a model and pose that fits your brand's look. Pitco Pilot gives you instant professional looking images while eliminating the costly photo shoot. It's basically a quick affordable alternative to traditional modeling that doesn't compromise on quality. If you haven't already, please consider subscribing and ringing the bell to get the latest marketing tips and tools to grow your business. Now let's go over how to make AI become your personal design studio by rapidly generating a product concept. Let's say you're thinking about launching a new water bottle line. For this concept generation, we'll use Dolly to quickly explore product variations and designs. Here's the prompt. Minimalist stainless steel water bottle, geometric pattern, matte finish, studio lighting. Now let's iterate. Same water bottle design, but with gradient color options and sustainable materials. 
See how quickly we can explore different concepts? Dolly is great for generating fresh product concepts quickly, which is ideal for testing designs before committing. When creating a concept board, you should always have a main product view, detailed shots, color variations, and lifestyle usage. Brands have been using this process for market testing, design validation, customer feedback, and production planning. But sometimes you don't need to generate images from scratch. You just need to make your existing photos better. So I'll show you a simple technique to remove objects and enhance your existing image. We'll use Adobe Firefly for this exercise, which is an excellent free tool for elevating your images with powerful AI powered enhancements. Once you have signed into your account, scroll down to find Generative Fill. You can then upload your image and select the area you'd like to edit, whether it's to remove an object or adjust the background. Here's how to clean this image by removing the lighting fixture next to it. In less than a minute, you can enhance your image without any technical editing skills. Here are some quick tips for better results. Start with the best quality original image. Use consistent lighting for all your shots. Keep the background simple and uncluttered and focus on one enhancement at a time for a natural polished effect. All right, let's do a one minute spotlight on a free tool making some noise in the branding space. Ideagram is fantastic for creating realistic images, logos, and promotional posters. Once you've logged in, you can enter a detailed prompt like a modern minimalist logo for a coffee shop named Simple Coffee Co. Featuring a circular design with a Simple Coffee Cup icon in the center. The text Simple Coffee Co. is displayed in a clean sans serif font below the icon. The color palette includes warm neutrals such as beige and taupe. And then click generate to view multiple logo options based on your description. Pretty cool, right? With this tool, you can rapidly explore creative designs or refine existing brand visuals. Now let's talk about how these images are being used in the real world. Using Dolly, you can create product shots for a catalog, making it easy to experiment with different backgrounds and settings to keep the look fresh. With Midjourney, you can generate unique lifestyle shots that add variety to your social media feed and test which visuals resonate with audiences without needing a photo shoot. Adobe Firefly is ideal for creating clean professional header images for your website. With its compliance features, you can confidently use these AI images in high visibility areas with no issues. An ideogram can be a great tool for rapidly creating personalized vibrant images for email marketing. Now let's go over the important part where and when to use AI images. Use AI for concept testing, lifestyle shots, and variations. Use real photos for main product images and detail shots. Combine both for marketing campaigns and social content. I'll wrap this segment up with some legal stuff you need to know when using these tools. The first is to always check usage rights. The second is to keep track of what's AI generated. And lastly, stay transparent with customers. Amazing, we've covered a ton today. From the best AI tools for product imagery and crafting perfect prompts, to virtual try-on techniques and quick editing tricks. Plus the most important part, how to actually use these images for your business. Remember, this isn't about replacing traditional photography completely. It's about giving your business the flexibility it needs when it comes to being efficient and reducing cost. All while testing concepts, creating variations, and producing content faster than ever before. If you've used AI tools for your business, please let us know in the comments section what the impact was and any lessons learned. Make sure to download our free guide in the description, which we've created to help you master everything we covered today, plus more tips to boost your content creation. I've linked it in the description for you. And don't forget to like and subscribe for more marketing tips and tools to grow your small business. See you on the next one.